Coastal erosion is a problem that periodically affects Scotland's shoreline and its communities. But research from the Scottish Government suggests that coastal erosion is affecting more of our coastline than has been the case historically. Dynamiccoast.com is a website that's just been launched by the Scottish Government and it shows maps and reports of how our coastline has changed over the last 120 years. Since the 1970s, three quarters of our soft shoreline, like these beaches behind me, have remained stable. 11% have built out seawards or accreted, whilst 12% have eroded landwards. That's 440 kilometres of shore experiencing erosion, the same distance as between Edinburgh and John O'Groats. When we compare the historical period to the recent period since the 1970s, then the proportion of coastline experiencing accretion has fallen by 22%. The amount of coast experiencing erosion has increased by 39%. And the rate of erosion, how quickly the land's been eaten back, has doubled from half a metre per year average to one metre per year average. The work's been commissioned so that the Scottish Government, the public sector, local authorities, communities and businesses can understand how our shoreline has changed in the past and how it may change into the future. For more information on the project, please visit dynamiccoast.com where you'll find reports, summaries and the web maps, of course.